It was a seven-year-old boy playing with toys about eight days ago. Yeah, I had it, man. Come on, yeah. Uh -huh. You know, that's what kids do. He just playing with toys. Little do he know, it's somebody outside his door want revenge and they shooting up houses. I don't know who the little boy related to, who he kin to, but the ops came to his house, shot it up. Blah, 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 blah. They didn't give a damn who was in the house. It could have been a kid, an old lady, your mama, a newborn baby. They didn't give a damn. They shooting the house up. This seven-year-old kid gets shot in the back from outside where the bullets was being sprayed at. Now remember, this is a kid, he ain't got nothing to do with no street stuff. He had his grandma's house. This is in the wild hundreds. He don't know what's going on. He just know his house is being shot up. This shorty catch a shot to the back. Uh. We finna talk about this. Hit the like button. Go on this video a thousand likes because a lot of people thought this shorty passed away. They thought this shorty died. This shorty was resilient, had a strong body. Can you believe this shorty opened his eyes up and started moving? They couldn't even believe this. People was preparing to bury this shorty. This shorty mom was preparing to bury him. Yeah, that's right. Uh, she said that one minute the family was waiting for this pizza to arrive and the next they all started running for cover. And uh, this family now tonight asking for not only support but prayers after having a nightmare for the past 24 hours. And by the grace of God, God touched him and that baby got up. Hit the like button. According to reports, seven-year-old Zayden, he in his grandma house chilling, uh, eating pizza. You know, they kicking it. He playing with all the toys. Next thing you know, somebody shoot up this house that he in. Blah, 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 blah. Shorty get hit in the back. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. All up here. I didn't know what to do. It was like, I'm trying to go here. I'm trying to deal with him. My grandson is on the floor. He's bleeding out. All he's doing is looking up at me, calling me, reaching for me, saying, Grandma, I'm shot. I told him, I said, baby, it's gonna be okay. My son is out here. He's on the ground. He's, mama, don't leave me. I'm shot in my chest. I hurt, I can't breathe. It was a lot. Look. They messed Shorty up so hard. When he got shot in the back, people thought Shorty was dead. He was so messed up, he had to have multiple surgeries, uh, blood transfusions. Um, it's a piece of his lung on the right side that he had to be taken out. It's a piece of his lung on the left that's not there no more. Man, this young man, is, is it's almost a mystery and, you know, magical that this young man alive. They said the young man opened up his eyes and started talking like ain't nothing ever happened. They say when he walked out the hospital, he said, it's cold out here. And all the doctors are like, a young man that little to take that brass of a bullet in his body to tear up his lungs, tear up all his internal stuff, and to still be here, still smiling, still laughing, didn't wake up, not scared, not talking about danger, but waking up saying it's cold. Like, he's still a kid, you know? This kid don't know what's going on. Does anything hurt anywhere? pretty good it was very bad because um, they had to give him two surgeries uh, he ended up with a half of a lung on the right side top part of the left lung um, is gone even the doctors and the nurses they were like we've never seen a recovery <laughs> like this something of a superhuman himself Zayden Garrett is headed home to his twin and thinking of a Halloween costume. What are you going to be for Halloween? A ninja tail. The police don't know why did they shut up that house. You know, that was his grandma's house. They don't know if somebody picked the wrong house, if they were shooting at another house and these bullets just went in his house. But the police say the house was shattered with bullets. So it makes it look like they were targeting that house. It's been a lot of shootings and house targetings on the south side of Chicago lately. So, you know, the police say they're going to work that case. But it was a lot of people that thought Zayden Garrett was dead you know it's a lot of people was preparing to bury that young man you know the news reported as if you know he's a baby that's an extra 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 critical 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 you know normally when you get somebody that's 17 18 and their 20s critical condition is bad enough but critical condition for somebody that's seven years old is extremely critical because they body and their organs just ain't strong enough to fight off you know things that an adult body can fight off but this baby body stood strong according to the police 
you know, this young man was shot violently and survived. And to the point where one of the first things he said was, it's cold out here. He didn't say, man, I'm all scared. Of mine. They try to kill me. This young man don't even really know what's going on. It's crazy as it's him. That's the goodness in your heart. When you innocent, you know, you move around like that. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. Uh, I want to say wishing a speedy recovery for that young man. And God is good to that young man family. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. It's the only truth. Blah!